Hey, Scotty, 53-year-old Rory Ford was a teacher at St. Amal High in Ascension Parish. The principal tells me he will no longer be on campus after his um, recent arrest. Cinema High School teacher Rory Four is in jail tonight in Ascension Parish, accused of raping two kids over several years. She had disclosed to one of her friends uh, something that had uh, possibly happened to her. So we were then contacted, our patrol division responded, and then called out our juvenile crimes unit. The 53-year-old was brought in for questioning after the allegations came to light. Chief of Criminal Operations with the Ascension Parish Sheriff's Office, Donald Capello, says Four confessed to the allegations. He actually admitted to having intercourse with our 16-year-old uh, victim over a period of time. He also admitted to a 17-year-old that uh, he had also had intercourse with over a period of time. Four is charged with first-degree rape and felony carnal knowledge of a juvenile. More charges could be filed. Because of the first-degree rape, we know uh, she was under 13. According to the Ascension Parish School Board, Four has been a teacher at Santa Mall since 1994. Although the charges are not related to Four's employment, juvenile unit detectives are working closely with the school system during the ongoing investigation. Santa Mall Principal Christina Carter released a statement saying, in part, we were informed by the Ascension Parish Sheriff's Office that an employee of Santa Mall High School was arrested as part of an APSO investigation. Although this investigation did not originate at our school, we will take a appropriate action in working with law enforcement and the individual will not be on campus. We're opening up uh, all investigations. Now, uh, from what we learned in the investigation, this did not have anything to do with the school. It, it was not at the school, didn't have anything to do with the school. Capello says it is important to tell someone if you or if you suspect someone you know is being abused. It needs to be reported uh, and we will investigate. We have special units set up to investigate these crimes. We can set up with counselors and uh, a myriad of other uh, help groups, you know, but you need to tell somebody. And of course, this remains an ongoing investigation. We will keep you updated over on our nine news app. Scotty. All right, Elise, thank you. With overdose deaths continuing to